Hi guys, it's Crypto of the Future here, and in today's video, I'm gonna show you a really, really nice project which is called Blockonomics. And as you can see, it's an ICO and the pre sale starts in 10 days and 11 hours. As, and you, as you can see, here is their website. And if you are interested in the ICO, you can obviously visit on their page, as the link is in the description. So, yeah, I really encourage you to, to see this. And what is Blockonomics? Uh, Blockonomics started in 2015 by Shiva S and Srinivas S and has been continuously innovating uh, just by introducing new features and products uh, which can enable cryptocurrency users with a right tools to manage and make the most of their bitcoins. And these services are meant to take up the individual tasks that a bank today performs and a lot of more. And the best feature here is the wallet watcher which notifies users of every transaction that happens on a user's wallet. Uh, it's just like an SMS sent by a bank and it's now most popular wallet watcher service in the world. As you can see, here is one of the Bitcoin transactions. Uh, as you can see, just you have a, a transaction received and you can just see how it works. You have an ellipse time and estimated confirmation time, which is really, really nice. As you can see here. And also one of the most important feature here is peer-to-peer uh, -peer invoices. Yeah, they were introduced, uh, which is, I think, the easiest way to send a Bitcoin invoice without worrying about fluctuating prices. And that's really, really important. And they have just decided to make an ICO. So yes, that's a really trustworthy company, as you can see, as they have a working product and the product is really, really great. You can just visit their page, uh, blockonomics.co, and now they have started an ICO, which the pre-sale starts in 10 days and let's visit the website on ICO. As you can see here, here are the products made by Blockonomics. As you can see, you have a Bitcoin Waller Watcher, you have a peer-to-peer -peer invoices, which I mentioned before, and also Block Explorer, obviously, which is really, really important to send the transactions. Also, you have a directly to wallet merchant service, uh, which allows merchants to accept Bitcoin directly to the HD wallets and no approvals and KYC it's required. So that's really nice. And that it just work, I think, uh, you can say that's, let's say, anonymously, uh, just because you don't have to, to show your ID or anything that is your personal data. So that's really, really nice. And one of the best features here is send Bitcoin via email. It's a decentralized way to send Bitcoins to your friends and family via email and no Bitcoin keys are stored on the services. So yeah, that's a really cool feature. And it's easier just for the basic users to send it via email. Uh, than on the blockchain. So that's a really, really nice feature, as I mentioned, and I really like this project. And here is the roadmap uh, for the ICO. As you can see on September, there will be more e-commerce integrations, uh, some like Shopify, Zenka, and many, many more. And as you can see on the December, the Block Explorer and blockchain improvements. So they will be just developing in the future as they've been doing for over three years, which is really, really, really great. And one of the best features is Lightning Network integration, which will be very, very important. As nowadays, uh, there is a problem with Bitcoin that despite it's a mothership, uh, there are certain aspects like a block size and transaction speed, uh, which aren't the best now. So that's a cool feature that they will integrate Lightning Network as then mm, the transactions will go really, really fast. So that will be June 2019. Then in November, uh, they will have a zero, conf zero confirmation payments mm -hmm. just using uh, the special uh, APE that detects possible double spends with high accuracy. Yeah, that's really also really nice features here. And here we go to the token sale. I think it's the most important thing in the ICO uh, just to check the token distribution and just uh, get know how the project will distribute the tokens and how they will develop and also they use the funds just to know how they will spend their money. Uh, just for you guys to know how uh, they will be managing uh, their money. So as you can see on the token distribution here, the 35% goes to the pre-sale. So that's really, really nice um, to invest soon in this ICO as the pre-sale, um, as you can see, is 45% and also the price will be, I think, lower. So that's a really, really good opportunity to buy some tokens. And then to the main sale goes 10%. Uh, to the growth fund 15%, 5% for supporters and 5% for a team, which is a quite good amount as on the other ICOs, 
it's about like 20% goes for a team. So the 5% here is a really, really low amount, but I think in my opinion, that's really, really great. Um, and here the 15% go to a founders and 5% to a private sale. Then you have a use of funds. Uh, they have 30% for a core platform development. So as you can see, they will be, they will be just focusing on development. So that's also really great. Uh, as you can see, they have a lot, a lot of features and plans on the roadmap. So uh, that would be great to use that money for development. Uh, then 10% for the platform integrations, 10% for open source development, 15% for sales and marketing, yeah, which is really uh, important in my opinion to focus on marketing. Uh, then 10% of contingency cover and 10% of community and promotional activities. And you have the sales information here. So here are the targets, so you can just read it on your own. Uh, let's go over here, we have a team and you can also check the link things, uh, which is really, really nice and transparent here. So yeah, that's really, really important uh, to check their link things. You can just see on which projects they've been working for. Uh, so obviously you can check it. Here is the C Shiva S, which is a CEO, and you can check uh, that he's been working on block economics uh, from 2015. So yeah, it's like three years of working on block economics. So yeah, that's really trustworthy company. And here's the light paper, the token paper and the white paper. So if you are interested, you can just read it on your own. The link to the website will be obviously in the description, as I said before. So if you are interested, it just um, 